There you are, YouTube. <laughs> Give me a button iota of a moment to make myself decent. Yes. That is much better. Do you not agree? <laughs> Good morrow, people of the YouTube area. <laughs> yes, tis I returning on this most illustrious of occasions to bring upon you a review, one that you, I'm certain, are interested in viewing. Because why else would you be here? Well, this review requested by none other than the one Erin MP8. Yes, I know your name. <laughs> His request was none other than Dark of the Moon. Or was it Mark of the Dune? I am not certain. I did not view the film, for I do not leave this room. <laughs> but he requested the movie version of Shockwave. His Voyager class, not that tiny piece of shite. In essence, he did implore me to review this. Yes. This is Shockwave's movie form, in his tank-like sort of mode that has treads, I suppose, and this gun thing, this gun thing that you can rotate about, and I don't know, perhaps detach it and fill it with the hose and what not. Yeah, you see, I've detached the hose. I've detached the bloody hose. Now he's useless. But... Do not fret. I have pictures! Boot shockwave from two separate angles. <laughs> now, behold him with his animated self. Animated shockwave, who also turns into some form of Cybertronian vessel tank type deal, if you will. Of course, Animated Shockwave has another vehicle mode, but that's not really Shockwave. That's his, his other personality, I suppose, which I can certainly <laughs> sympathize with him there. <laughs> but these things lie in the past, no present. They lie in the future, for I am not there yet. Give me time. Let us continue into robot mode. So then, let us not waste any more time with the Cybertronian tank when we have this glorious robot. Oh yes, it makes everything seem so nice, does it not? Notice the singular cycloptic eye is so beautiful. And of course, he went and replaced one of his hands with an instrument of destruction. <laughs> ah, Shockwave, I like your style. <laughs> Have a closer look at Shockwave. He looks very good. Don't you agree? And have another look at him with his animated counterpart. Yes, the animated counterpart. Well, very nice. Lacks the tube coming out of his back. 
which is just so endearing on the Dark of the Moon version. Both of them leave a Voyager class, though, so the animated one gets a certain amount of credit for being so large. But still, the Dark of the Moon version plays much better to Shockwave's personality. I do not know how the movie went with him, but, uh, well, I'm betting the character was, how do I put this, bad. So there you have it, YouTube. There you have it, Aaron MB8. A review. <coughs> a review of that shockwave. He's a very good figure. And if any of you do not have him, do not allow your qualms about the movie line. Take this one down. For he truly is an inspiration. An inspirational piece of plastic that would go in quite nicely with your Decepticon forces. So... Until next time, YouTube, I bid you a fond farewell. Until next time, YouTube. Until next time. <laughs>